They don't like it. We could have a woman of the year and a man of the year. I like that. Okay, here's Drudge's report. Drudge, he's starting to treat me good again. He's starting to like me again. I like him. Look, Trump and Ted Cruz, I can say he came in second. You know, he was a great debater. And Marco came in third. And a guy who I don't like much, and they don't like him much in Ohio either, Kasich. Kasich. He was way down, way down. Okay, look, who won? Trump? Okay. Here's another one. Look, again, a different one, Time Magazine. Trump, 33%. Ben Carson, good man, he was down. Marco, Jeff, Ted. Carly Fiorina, a name I haven't heard in a long time. What happened to Carly? And Rand, good poll. Here's the sir, look. But way up, way up. Look at this. Here's another one. Look at this. Trump, 46%. I didn't make this up. Here's another one. This is a different debate. I don't know. They're all different. I want every one of them. Look, Trump, I just took these at random. 46%, second, 5%, 3%, 5%, 3%, 9%, 5%, 11%. Trump, 46%. Here's another one. CNBC. Well, you know, the market's been up. They've actually been not so bad. And Joe Kiernan is a good guy. He is a good guy. Some of the rest I don't care for too much. Becky's like, she plays it a little bit down the middle, right? Which is okay. Trump, almost 50%. Then they have all the rest of them. 14, 4, 3, 2, 2.8, 2 2.5, 4, 1.9. I'm not going to give you the names. I won't tell you that. I got 48.8. And Jeb Bush, Jeb Bush got 1.1. <laughs> the rest I'm not going to talk about. But he hasn't been exactly a great supporter. You know? Sort of a never Trumper, I guess. So Jeb, 1.9, 1.1. And Trump, 48. That's another one. Oh, here's a nice one. Here's a nice one. Look at this. Look at this. Trump, 70 percent. Next one is 18 percent. Next one is 7, 4, 3, 3, 3, 2, 1, 1, 1. Trump didn't do well in the debates. See, they're fake news. Here's another one. Trump kicked ass. Trump kicked ass. Trump 48. Number two was six. Here's another one. Trump 75.6. Crooked Hillary was 24%. This was against Crooked Hillary. So look at that. Trump was 74.6. Crooked Hillary Clinton was 24.1. Trump was 80%. Crooked Hillary was 18%. And I've got this woman. You know who it is, right? You know, you, nobody knows her name. I'm not going to mention. But everybody knows Neil Cavuto. She has no credibility, and neither do you, Neil Cavuto. Here's another one, Crooked Hillary. And by the way, one is a Fox poll, one is Breitbart, one is a Drudge Report, one is a Patch, one is Syracuse.com, one is Pollitt Opinion. Oh, that's a good one. But look at these numbers. Trump, 92. What is this? So I'm winning every poll. I beat Crooked Hillary. Here's the one. Trump, 61, crooked Hillary, 39, okay? That's what it is. And then I turn on the damn show on Fox. Again, it's not the same. It was much better. It really was. It was much better. I turn on Fox, and I've got this third-rate political journalist, if you call her that, saying, Trump did very poorly in the debates, but he became president. No, I did great in the debates. I became president because of the debates, because unlike Minnie Mike, I could answer questions.
And here's the final one. And I could get you another 15. These are all the ones that are taken right after. People call in hundreds of thousands of people. They call in Time Magazine, CNBC. So here's a CNBC. Crooked Hillary Clinton, 39 percent. Donald Trump, 61 percent. And then this stupid person said, I didn't debate. Well, now, look, you know, I don't mind. And you can have bad debates. But I won every single debate. And then I, then I listened to this. Then three and a half, four years later, I have to listen to a person saying how we didn't do well, because these people are among the most dishonest people anywhere in the world. Take it, take it. There it is. Okay. Let's get back to business. Now I feel good. Now I feel good. She's a third-rate journalist. Let's go. We're standing up in defense of our Constitution, our freedom, and democracy itself, right? While the extreme left has been wasting America's time and doing all sorts of vile hoaxes, we went through hoaxes, we went through the impeachment scam. And by the way, Corey was with us all the way. He didn't move, he didn't budge.